What sacrifices have you made to be successful in your small business? That is a question many business owners ask themselves. For some, the answer is easy. They've had to give up time with their family, friends, and even time for themselves. They've had to work long hours, put in extra effort, and make tough decisions. But for others, the answer is not so clear. Maybe they haven't made any sacrifice at all. Or maybe others have made sacrifices for them. In this video, we will explore successful small business owners' sacrifices that they've done to achieve success and those they don't make. Stay tuned. In this video, we will explore successful small business owners' sacrifices to achieve success and those they don't make. First, however, let me introduce myself. My name is Doug Barra, and I've been working with the owners of local businesses for over 16 years, and I am the owner of a local small business. I believe that the owners of small local businesses are some of the most courageous people in the world. So I commend you for being one. You had a calling or you wanted to do what you do better than you could do working for someone else. Or maybe you were just tired of working for someone else. Whatever caused you to go into business for yourself, you put yourself and your family on the line. You said, this will be and you've been making it happen. Now, you have also made sacrifices. I know because I made sacrifices and everyone I have coached over the last 16 years has made sacrifices. And one thing I've noticed over the years is that some sacrifices make a difference and help move the business forward and some do not. Unfortunately, some will ultimately damage your business. Let's start with the sacrifices that do not work. Sacrificing your dreams, your ideals, or your integrity does not work. You will not be successful if you give up on your dreams. You will not be successful if you do what is easy instead of what is right. And you will not be successful if you allow others to take advantage of you or your business. So what does work? What sacrifices do small business owners make to help them succeed. The first one is time. Time with your family, friends, or even yourself. Small business owners have to work long hours. They often have to put in extra effort on nights and weekends. They sometimes have to miss important events because they have to work. However, this is not a permanent thing. Over time, continuing to sacrifice time with family, friends, or yourself will be detrimental to you and your business. You will become resentful and burned out. So make sure to be looking at your structures and your team to continue to get back your time. Work with a professional to ensure that you are creating your business in a sustainable way for you and your team. The second sacrifice is money. Small business owners have to be very careful with their money. They often have to invest much of their own money into their business. They may have to forego a salary to reinvest in their business. However, this is also not a permanent thing. You should not continue investing all your money into your business without taking any out. You need to live too. So make sure you pay yourself a salary to live comfortably while still investing in your business. Ultimately, your business should not only pay you a salary, but pay you dividends. Therefore, if you are not making more from your business than your team members are, and I mean individually, in other words, at some point you should be the highest paid person in your business, you will want to consult with those who know how to get your business to that point. Most people realize these sacrifices, but I said there were things you need to sacrifice that you may not know. What might those be? One that I have seen is going it alone. Thinking no one can help or do it as well as you can is not valid. You need a team, you need help, and you need to delegate. Hiring a professional to help with the day-to-day -day operations of your business can be one of the best investments you ever make. 
It will free up your time so that you can focus on what only you can do in your business and allow you to take vacations without fear that your business will fall apart. Sometimes you even have to sacrifice that the team members can do it as well as you do. They may never be able to, but if they can do it 75% as well as you do, and you have three of them, overall, they will do a better job than you can. And some will eventually get better at it than you are. Another big one I see small business owners making is not asking for help when they need it. Many resources are available for small businesses, but small business owners are often too proud to ask for help. They think they should be able to figure it out on their own, but this is not the case. There is nothing wrong with admitting that you need help. In fact, this is the most, one of the most brilliant things you can do for your business. People out there have made it their life's work to help small businesses succeed. Utilize these resources to take your business to the next level. So those are some of the sacrifices small business owners need to make to be successful. What others would you add? Let me know in the comments below. And if you found this helpful, be sure to share it with other small business owners who may need to hear this message. Would you like to learn more about what causes success or other topics regarding business success? Yes? Great! Then there are a few things that you need to do right now. First, like this video so I know that you got value, and I'll make more videos like this one. Second, subscribe to this channel and click the bell to get notified whenever we post a new video so that you don't miss a single piece of the valuable information we share. And last, click the link in the description to register for the next live web class we hold on Thursdays and unearth the secrets to scaling your business. This is a tremendous opportunity to go even deeper into these ideas. You can also register by going to www.businesssuccess.group forward slash scaling live. That's www.businesssuccess.group forward slash scaling live. I'm Doug Barra, and I'm passionate about helping small businesses succeed. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in our next video.